How is he? Sleeping. He should be out for a while. Is this getting to be a regular hangout for you? I don't know what else to do. I know. If Shane doesn't get a donor soon, his immune system is wiped out. Hey, did you hear how many people showed up for Vicky and Charlie's donor drive? Michael is checking the National Registry on the hour. There's got to be somebody out there, right? Right. I'm still trying to get the hang of this whole prayer thing. Bo said there's no right or wrong way to do it. I really think that it'll work. You don't? I tried it myself last night, and this morning Michael tells us that Shane needs the transplant, and soon... If he dies... Okay, he is not going to die. It's not going to happen. <laughs> it does happen, Rex. There are a lot of kids. Okay, not ours. Not ours. Now, we need to stay positive, Marasco. I want to. And you are. In front of Shane, anyway. You really believe that it's all going to turn out all right? I have to believe that. I used to be strong. Oh. When I knew there were answers... When all it took was an inhaler to fix things, I could work overtime to pay for it and put a happy face on. But this, Rex, I don't, I don't know how to pretty this up. You just don't give up hope. I won't, but hope alone is not going to do it. We need a real, live person to save Shane's life. I, I want to do something. And praying doesn't feel like doing something. Didn't you used to go to church back in Michigan? Yeah, every Sunday. I used to believe in faith and hope, charity. But then I got pregnant and you left before I could tell you and my father kicked me to the curb, so I kind of felt like God turned his back on me. And Shane. And if, if we were going to get by, it had to be up to us. I get that. I never even went to church, but recently in this past year, I'm starting to believe in miracles. We can't just hope for a miracle and poof, Shane's all better. I'm a realist, Balsam. I've had to be. I know. We just have to look harder for a donor, and we should look for another oncologist, too. I read online about people who have their own bone marrow harvested. It could be dangerous, but it could save Shane's life. We'll do anything, even pray for a miracle. But no, I'm, I'm not. I'm not talking about hocus pocus miracles. I just know stuff happens, and they make other things happen, like us. You think we're a miracle? What were the odds of me walking into a diner in Texas looking for somebody that we both knew and you just happened to be working there that hour? Marcy could have picked any place on earth, but she chose Paris, Texas. We could have just missed each other. Your, your shift could have been over. It could have been a weekend. But that didn't happen, Marasco. The stars were lined up, and I have to believe that that was for a reason, and that reason is our son. So, what? We're supposed to just leave it all in the hands of fate? Or God? No. We'll do everything humanly possible. But we have to believe that Shane is going to beat this. We have to believe. Gigi. scared as hell. Did you right? God wouldn't just take him away, would he? I can't believe that. There's no other way to believe. And if that isn't faith, I don't know what is.